from Makeup on Aisle 64 and I want to welcome you to planning with me on September 28th through September 30th. On tomorrow, which is October 1st, I'll be starting my 31 days of planning, but in the meantime, we're going to finish out the month of September 28th through the 30th. And I went ahead and just kind of got the layout all done so you could just kind of see what I had done. I'm still working with the purple and the green and as you know I love my paper tiles so I had a bunch of planning goodness that I had set aside specifically for this particular collection but here are some of the papers that I used for example this purple and um, yellow and green here comes from this particular page and it is from the Fresh Stack Floral Collection and if you notice the different colors on this particular page you notice that depending upon where I cut it you'll get a different look so I just really love those so there's that these this tile here comes from this particular strip and again from the uh, the floral stack but they did have some stripes and a few things like that in it. And then I also had something like this. But I'm kind of out of this one now, so I don't have the whole sheet to show you. This particular one here comes from this page, which came from the Everyday Essentials stack. And if you notice, when I trim the page down, again, depending upon where I cut it, sometimes the pages take on a little bit different color. I've been loving this yellow floral in all of the layouts, and I'm about down to the last couple of little tiles with that one. And then this is another one that I was using with this particular layout, and it comes from that same collection. There was either the fresh floral stack or there was like a patterns and stripes and different things like that stack that I had. So those are where I've been getting my paper tiles from. This particular card here comes from my Becky Higgins Project Life and this is her High Five edition and I just love the card how I can just kind of you can write some notes on the back of it. I put a little bit of washi tape here to stick it down. And then on top of that, I've got some birthday stickers and some other things, which I'll explain in a minute. And then these little uh, cameras, Instagram, and then the planner stickers and the Dare to Dream come from my orders from either the Reset Girls shop or from the Reset Girls Lister's Got a List kit. So this Dare to Dream comes from this um, Me and My Big Ideas pocket pages which came out of the August Lister's Got a List kit. My cupcakes to celebrate my granddaughter's birthday come from the Jolie Boutique. And then the Planner Attic was from this set of uh, stickers that I ordered as well as the camera and Instagram. And then, of course, my clinical sticker comes from the Jolie's um, Nurse Collection. So now, what do I have going on this week? Well, on Monday is my granddaughter's birthday. She is 12. So I just kind of cut some pictures of her face, just different kind of images. Just not the whole face, but just different little corners and pieces and put it right here on this Becky Higgins card and it just says collect memories tell your story and then here I've got some pictures of her she has such a nice smile and you can see the smile here in her eyes and then here she's intently working on a project which she's always working on some kind of a craft product project and then of course the cupcakes here to celebrate her birthday and again here hip hip hooray her birthday again so Monday, September 28th, I'm celebrating my little granddaughter's, Jordy's birthday. 7.30 that morning, however, I'll be on my regular 
Momentum Monday call and it's a motivational call that I get on to kind of help me get going for the week and the number is there. I put it there so that I don't have to spend time looking for it. And then I will be in my office that day so if I need to write in some appointments or different things like that I can get those in here. On Tuesday is also my office hours so I put a little um, clipboard here with some appointments that I know I have to keep that day. My RNBS calls, my Blackboard management grading, um, put them on some announcements for my students on Blackboard as well as reviewing some notes. So I know that's going to be going on uh, Tuesday morning while I'm in the office. And then I just wanted to put this little planner attic note here because I do try to use something each week from my research, Reset Girl collection in my layouts. On Wednesday, it's a clinical day, so I don't usually have a lot of things planned, but my students are starting to do their teach plans now, so I'll probably have a couple scheduled. So I put this clipboard there so I can schedule those. And then, of course, the stethoscope represents my clinical day. And then the Dare to Dream, as I mentioned earlier, came from this uh, collection of, from Pocket Pages. So this is what I have going on for Monday the 28th through Wednesday the 30th. And I forgot to tell you where I got this from. Hang on just a second, and I will grab that. Those little clipboards come from Oh So Pretty Paper. So these little clipboards come from Oh So Pretty Paper. I ordered those from her on her Etsy shop. So that's what I've got going on this week. This is my planning and I really appreciate the fact that you decided to plan with me for the days of September 28th through September 30th and I hope you'll join me tomorrow as I kick off my 31 days of planning for the month of October. Music